Remember game of a three game set, Myrtle Beach and Carolina. Fans are firing up as the Pelicans looking for their second series win in the second half. And this will help Tyler Pearson with his new swing this year, his third home run, and the Pelicans a two to one lead they would not relinquish. Still in the second inning, Roberto Caro into left center field. Corey Ray runs it down, but Adonis Paula scores in the sacrifice fly to make it three to one. Next batter, Zach Short who extends his on-base streak to 14 games in a row with an RBI single to make it 4-1. Then some really good defense. Jesse Hodges in the fifth inning sliding to his left to get the runner Wendell Riho. And then in the sixth inning going to his right, tremendous play from Hodges to get Avilas and Myrtle Beach keeping it a 4-2 game into the ninth. Scott Efros on for the save and more Hodges. This is a jump throw coming in from third and it seals Myrtle Beach's second series win of the second half. Pelicans win it four to two, and they're 61 and 58, 18 and 31 and half two, and Carolina falling to 57 and 61, and 21 and 29. Tyler Pearson the story with his two-run homer. Connor Meyer is also a two-hit game for Myrtle Beach, and a really good job by the Pelicans pitching today. Kyle Miller wins. He's four and three with two runs on five hits in five innings. Mark Huberman an inning and two-thirds scoreless. Tommy Thorpe an inning and one-third scoreless. And Scott Efros, a scoreless ninth for his sixth save. Burns go on the road, long eight game, seven day road trip, five at Winston-Salem and three at Wilmington. They'll be back in Myrtle Beach on August the 22nd to begin their final homestand of the 2017 regular year. <laughs>